Hello, this is one very bill. My wonderful wife woke me up today and says, Hey, how about go in, in the kitchen and fix me some melon? I said, You want watermelon can, no honey do? What do I do? She said, Well, honey, would you go do a cantaloupe for me? So, yes, sweetie, whatever you like. So I went to the kitchen, got my surgical equipment, a couple of knives, a couple of scoops, and we're going to cut my sweetie some melon for breakfast. So, first of all, a lot of folks, I'm going to do a, uh, a little basket for her, being it's a holiday weekend, or any time you can do this for the one you care about a lot. Just go ahead, some folks like to mark where they're going to cut, <laughs> us old timers, this is so much that you don't have to mark it. It's quick and easy. Now, I take a Mellow's a ice cream scooper. Cut out these pieces to give that to my wonderful woman. Just like that is. Or do them up in slices for her. I'm sorry. I better show the proper way to slice the melon after you cut it there and you want to do slices. Just lay it on the flat now and slice it. And you can serve them slices of this, so I'm going to do that other one. Cut it up off and move that over a little bit. Yeah, and if you want thin slices, you just cut them thin. If you want thick slices, you cut them thicker. And if you want to dice it, you just cut them babies off there now. I'm going to switch knives. You got a bowl for the trays. And you got bowls for the good stuff. Of course, before y'all... Mmm, mmm. Yeah, it is good, sweet. Really great flavor. I was gonna say before you guys want to serve it to your wonderful significant other, you do want to try it. Make sure it's okay for her. Yeah. So you can just dice it up, like I say, serve it that way. And it's wrapped. Hmm. through, trim up, get as close to the green as you can, or tan, or whatever color that might be. Whoa, try to get it in the bowl. Miss Betty once been a little under the weather this weekend. We've been trying to take care of her the best that we can. Keep peace and harmony in the family. <laughs> uh, sometimes I think I'm crazy. Not really. Don't ever do as I do. Just do as I say. Alright. So we got the melon now. We're going to get out the seeds. Of course, I didn't mention you always want to wash that melon first. Yeah, you don't want to serve your significant other a contaminated melon. So you make sure you wash it so it's nice and clean for her. Don't want to get any of that salmonella. The other thing, once you cut it, you should not leave it unrefrigerated for more than three hours. And even 
that long, you should have it on an ice bed to keep it chilled down. So now we got this little basket. Now we're going to do a little trim work on it. See what happens here. Oh, good. That's how easy that is to trim out. Push that little sucker out. I am on my meds, so no big deal. A senior, you know, you gotta do your meds every now and then. To keep healthy. You know, my Miss Betty's not watching. <coughs> That's the best melon I had all day. I'll tell you. Really awesome. I'm gonna go ahead and cut down before I scoop that out. A couple ways to do that. And scoop it with your, with your whatever, with your ice cream scoop, with the spoon. This one is actually measuring spoons. Anybody wants to do a real tiny melon bowl, use your your little one eighth teaspoon, or a teaspoon, or a half teaspoon, or a tablespoon. If you want to do something fancy on top of it. Display with uh, with the melons. Now I'm just going to do some larger pieces because we're hungry. If we're doing a party, a little get together, we would go ahead and uh, just do some fancy melon balls. Add in some strawberries. Watermelon, kiwi, star fruit, whatever you like to mix in there. Uh, mandarin orange slices are great. So even if you get the can and drain them, mix them in. But when there's just a couple seniors that don't remember a lot around the house. Do something cute, do a basket. Alrighty. Yes. Now some people I'm gonna fancy it up a little. Again, some people like to mark that. They feel it's they'll get it straight and even, which is true. But old Bill trying to get his lovely wife her morning breakfast. I don't want her to fall back to sleep after she so nicely woke me up with her honeydew list. So, here we go. We're going to serve her breakfast in bed. But Mama can I say, she's a wonderful woman, so I try to be nice to her every now and then. I remember, I remember when, before I met this young lady, my life just wasn't full. And now, what more can I ask? Absolutely nothing. She gave me two wonderful grandchildren. Separating and Savannah, you see her on many videos. I will one Betty Bill. I'm going to scoop out a little more melon from the bottom here. And stop the nonsense talk before she overhears me in the bedroom there and speaks the <coughs> out of me. There you go. Very nice. Now you can do a couple of things. If the flowers were in bloom outside, I could run out there and poke a little hole in here and put a nice little little flower in. Being they're not in bloom right now, I'm going to run over to the living room and see what kind of artificial thing I can find to put in there. 
I hate to do that to my hun. Because she's the real thing. So I found myself a day with I'm gonna I poked a hole in there and I'll look at that to have a little green in there. Really nice. You could take, you know, a holiday weekend, Fourth of July coming up, stick a couple stars in there, fill up with your fruit, and you're all set. I'm gonna just do strawberries and cantaloupe today because that's what she requested. Strawberries. I gotta get them from the fridge in a minute. I'm gonna some of this dye stuff and uh, put a few of them in there right now we get a few strawberries make sure you wash them off and being we're going to have breakfast in bed today uh 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 Little strawberry, little glass of orange juice, and or sunny D, whichever you prefer. You can put the chunks back in, you can put the melon balls back in if you want bigger pieces. But again, make sure your hands are clean, wash your hands every once in a while. I was out painting yesterday, so I got a little paint on my hands. Yeah, but I scrub them as good as I can. It's non-lead paint, so she don't have to worry, of course. But here we go. This, I thought I brought more than... There they are. Beautiful little basket for your significant other for a breakfast treat. Again, Give her a little fork, put it on a tray or platter, and you're all set. If this don't make her day, nothing will. Alright, I got my tray all set up for Miss Betty. I'll be taking it to her pretty soon, and I'll lay down and enjoy it with her. Uh, again, just wanted to show you how quick and easy it is to make a special... Uh, breakfast for your significant other and uh, just something a little different. I did put a little drink on there, a little orange juice, but what I did a little different, I took a jello cup and I put in there, put in the bottom, poured the juice on top and then the jello cup likes to float in there then all you have to do is take a spoon take a spoon and stir it in or just drink the juice and then enjoy the jello again you all have a great day it's a great way to start your day have a good one thank you